Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some pretzel sticks. These are from Zaps. Uh, Zaps Sinfully Seasoned Pretzel Sticks, New Orleans style. I have the Jazzy Honey Mustard. Now, voodoo. These were $6.29 each at Tractor Supply, and I want to give a shout out to Christian because somebody left uh, somebody left me a comment and said, hey, you got to try those uh, new pretzel sticks from Zaps, and I said, I've been looking for them for weeks, weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks, mm -hmm. probably a month or over, and Christian left a comment and said, I found mine at Tractor Supply. Christian, I would have never no, in my that's not a place wildest, we go into. no, I wouldn't, I, we hadn't been in there in, I don't think years, mm -hmm. um, but we went in and they were right inside the door on a display, mm -hmm. so thank you so much. Yeah, for, really for appreciate that, it. Or, because it's so funny, Tractor Supply has them, but no grocery stores. Yeah, it's weird. Walmart and Kroger and all these places around us and even the next town over. We haven't found them anywhere, so that's just weird. Uh, I don't know why that would be. This is a one pound bag for $6.29. Zapp's Sinfully Seasoned Pretzel Sticks bring a new twist on New Orleans inspired flavors. These pretzels are twisted to hold more of our special secret seasonings. This recipe includes premium ingredients and special spice blends to create a pretzel experience that's irresistibly Zapp's. So many people love Zapp's potato chips. See what we've done to perfect the pretzel. We thank you for buying our product. Enjoy. And laissez les bon temps. <laughs> uh, okay, so 16 servings, one ounce, 28 grams, about 15 pretzels is 120 calories. I'm assuming these are going to be like the, well, the twist. I like a good honey mustard. I don't really get a strong mustard smell. Man. I don't either. They're very well coated in something. Yes. You don't smell it. You taste it, son. Wow. <laughs> that tastes just like the, uh, what are those? Snyder's of Hanover? Mm -hmm. The sourdough ones. Those, those Honey ones. mustard. Yeah. Yeah, they're really good. Those chopped ones. Kevin they're likes big chunky them. ones. Kevin likes those chopped ones. The biggest difference between these and those, the flavor is pretty much the same. Mm -hmm. It's that Very same good. strong honey mustard. Mm -hmm. The difference between the Snyder's and these is because it's smaller pieces, they're crispy. They're very, they're almost hard. Yeah. The are. They're very, very crispy and crunchy and there's a lot to, to chew there. It's real crispy. Mm -hmm. but These now, are almost like breadsticks. Yeah. If you need something, if you've had those before and you thought, wow, those were too hard. Because I like those. I think those are nice. Mm -hmm. There's nothing wrong with those. But these won't be as hard for you to eat. Mm -hmm. No, but they say they have that same great Exactly flavor. the same honey mustard flavor. Yeah. I think they're nice. They're very good. They're, they're, I would buy them anyway. Yeah, same honey <laughs> mustard flavor. It just depends on what texture you prefer. Do yeah, you really. prefer a softer texture or do you want that crunch? You yeah, because those are like sourdough pretzels and they're, they're really, really hard. Yeah. Um, these are almost breadstick. Okay, oh. these. Ooh, gosh, that smells so good. Yeah, you can get the seasoning from that. This is the voodoo, and I love those voodoo chips. Uh, 15 pretzels, 120 calories. These have, like, paprika, garlic powder. By the way, this one, didn't really mention it, but it really does have a really good, like, honey mustard flavor. Yeah. It's got a little of that sweetness from the honey, and then you get that, that tang and vinegary mustard flavor. It's really, really good. To me, this tastes like it has vinegar. It, it definitely has some vinegar or some something like sharp in there. Mm hmm. Something acidic. Yes. I don't know. Smoke flavoring. You get mm -hmm. the smoke flavoring. Yeah. Almost tastes like something you'd have on a piece of meat, like a rib or a barbecue chicken. That would be an awesome like seasoning that. on her. I wonder if they sell their seasoning. Uh, like voodoo seasoning so should. that you could put it on ribs because that would be really good not only does it have seasoning it's weird because there's a little sweetness coming through too mm -hmm. no i get that too those are nice now 
I, I'm picturing a chicken leg. Huh? A barbecue chicken leg with that flavoring on it. That's what I'm tasting. No, I think that would be good too. That'd be good. Uh, even like if you glaze. even if you baked chicken, yeah, and you you put the seas seasoning on it, they should sell powder. They yeah, should sell powder. That'd be a good idea. They might. I don't or a know. liquid sauce you can put on stuff. That'd be good too. Oh yeah, I I don't know. I think I would rather have a powder. powder than the liquid. I do like these very much. Mm -hmm. I like uh, the pretzels. Now I'm gonna choose if they if you had these side by side with the potato chips. I'm gonna choose the potato chips because potatoes. would you? Mm -hmm. Because I like a, a, a nice greasy <laughs> salty potato chip um, over pretzels any day. Uh, but I very much like these. I, think I always flavor, think of pretzels as a little healthier. I think the flavor is a little stronger with these. Uh, I don't know. The, I think the chips are pretty strong the, too. The chips are pretty strong, but yeah. I don't know. This this comes across as that kind of sweet barbecue-y kind of flavor. Just, they're really, both of them are really good. I agree. I think they're both good. I think these are, are going to be very successful. I hope you all can find yeah. them. If you have a tractor supply, give it a try. Yeah. They may be there. Well, you'll have to let us know because that is an odd place. You'll have to let us know. Did you find these in your regular grocery store if you've tried them, or did you find them in some oddball place? Because Tractor Supply, you have to admit, that's an oddball place. They don't have a lot of food there. No, actually, that's the only thing they had was that one little stand. They had, had some that candy. display, and, and then they had, yeah. Some candy up front. Some candy, but I mean. That's that, all we call, at least. Yeah, that, that's it. So, uh, just an odd place to find these. Uh, but I will have a picture for you at the end. I like them both. Though. Yeah, they're both equally good, just they're very different. Yeah. So, thanks for watching.